Hey guys, hey, I got another tip here and I discovered this in iMovie because I'm actually editing our vacation video from this summer. So what I want to show you today is how to go and add more clips. Let's say for instance, just uh, I'll show you here. I just went and added a bunch of more clips in to my uh, library here. and. What I did was I pulled them off my iPhone. So I loaded up my Canon DSL. I dumped all those photos, the, the video clips in, and then I had the photos on my iPhone. So I just went and copied those and got those dumped in. Okay, so they actually put them in date orientation for the uh, movie. So, but what it doesn't do is it doesn't drop the videos inside the timeline. So let's say for instance, I've got some uh, clips here. I'm just gonna go and do uh, one real quick here for you. Let's see, so let's get here. And let's say I've got the kids at the pool here. Let's see if I've got some, some good footage here. So let's say I go and grab this here. It's my son Parker, so we're gonna do grab that clip and I'm gonna hit plus just like I always do but it's dropping it to the back of the of the timeline here so I'm gonna show you how to add those real quick and then I'm gonna go and find another clip here there's a nice shot of the pool 3.1 seconds there I'm gonna add that and I'll grab one more clip here what's pretty funny is when you've uh, turn your kids loose with video cameras, with uh, waterproof cameras, and to actually be able to get good footage. <laughs> it can be uh, challenging at times. So I'm gonna go and find just one more, one more shot here. I think I just saw something here that looked good. So um, 8.3 seconds, so I'm gonna add those. So I've got these three shots here, and I'm gonna go and do a, uh, I'm gonna highlight one, and then I'm gonna hit the command key and uh, we're gonna get these all three highlighted. I'm just gonna hold the shift key. See that? I've got all three of them highlighted now. So now I'm gonna go and actually take them and drag them. I'm gonna drag them all the way down the timeline here, hang on. I'm gonna go find out where I need to dump these bad boys in. So let me just give me a second here. So right here, we're gonna go and dump those bad boys in, okay? So now all three of them have been date coded back to where I want them to be. So now when I play that back, we've got in the right order, the right sequence where I want them at for the project. So anyhow, that's my tip for the day. So. We'll catch you next time.